See what's on. Let's see what bands are gonna play Warp Tour. Um, let's see. We got Bear Tooth. Thing as an ocean. Hell yeah. Mm, dance Kevin Dance. Yeah. Okay. Hawthorne Heights. Hell yeah, man. Hands like houses. I prevail. I might go see them. Mm, damn. Neck deep. Uh. Who else? Silverstein. Hell yeah, dude. Stick to your guns. Sworn in. Oh man. T S O L. I just saw these guys. Yeah. Tiger Army. Damn, man. Who else? I guess that's it. Oh, shit. Oh. Hey, I didn't see you there. <laughs> uh, wait, I think Jeffrey may have. Jeffrey, did you. Did you leave the camera rolling? How long is this thing been? Hold on. No, this is not a plate. What's up, guys? How's it going? Toasty right here. Uh, I'm gonna hit you up with a, a update video today. Uh, I did some a few things to the truck uh, off camera. I guess I should probably talk about the the environment, huh? So uh, we're in the man cave right now, aka my room, the place where I get a lot of work done, and the same place where I don't get anything done. I would give you guys a tour, but maybe later. Uh, currently chilling here with my cats. Gonna meet uh, Kajita and uh, the other babies over there, but forget about the other girl. Uh, I want to talk about a few things that's gonna happen pretty soon. Um, I recently uh, was hanging out with uh, the vice president of Diamond Squad Car Club. It's a it's a car club of like a uh, mostly consisted of. Honda Civics and stuff like that. Uh, I used to own a uh, a Acura Integra, so I still I'm pretty into those cars. They're dope. And um, yeah, he was telling me about these like Tuesday car meets that they have. They don't discriminate. They have all kinds of vehicles. So I'm definitely planning on taking my camera there and getting some footage, you know, and just make a video about that. I don't know what you guys think about that, but that's gonna be coming up hopefully this Tuesday. This Tuesday, I might go for sure. Might for sure makes no sense. I might go. I'm gonna check it out. See what that's out. See what that's like. <laughs> so, I did some work to the truck. Um, been trying to peel off the plastic dip off the rims, and I mean, we we're getting there. We're getting there. Uh, it still have a few, a, a little bit of spots on there. Uh, I also installed a stereo. Install some door speakers. Oh, and I painted the grill and the bumper. So we'll show you that right now in a bit. Yeah, man, I'm just chilling, man. I just got off of work about an hour ago. I guess Jeffrey wanted to make a video, so that's what we're doing. Plus, I also had some coworkers asking about where the videos have been. As for the Chrysler, well, it's currently missing its stereo because I used it to put it into the truck. Uh, not really a big deal though. At uh, first, I didn't really want to touch the sound system because I spent a lot of money on that uh, system for that car. But uh, I figured I might as well, you know, since uh, it's not going to be registered in a while, I figured I should because I, I, I want to learn uh, fabrication, you know. So um, that area where I had the stereo originally at, uh, I plan on, you know, working with uh, body fill and stuff like that. Hopefully, making like a I don't know, something cool, you know, like a cool, it's got a cool dash. So we'll see videos about that soon. Uh, hopefully, you guys stay in tune. Stay tuned for that. So here's what the rims are looking like. You know, there's chrome on the face. You know, like right here, and there's still plastic dip. You know, on the insides, and a little bit on the rear. Uh, We'll get them off soon. It's just, it, it's annoying. You know, when you, if you don't do plastic dip right, by the way, I didn't do these, but if you don't do plastic dip right, it's annoying when you want to take it off. 
and it definitely doesn't last either. Um, let's show you the stereo. So, this stereo was the same stereo from my Chrysler. I'm um, pretty sure I'm just gonna get a different one. I mean, I love the stereo. The stereo is great, by the way, but. Uh, oh! <laughs> I'm forgetting. I also cleaned the cluster. This was annoying. I thought I broke it. But I cleaned it. If you guys remember from last video, that thing was dusty, man. But it looks really good. Let's, let's get a nice shot of that real quick. Chrysler's gonna get some work on its stereo situation. We're not worried about that right now. We'll figure that out later. Check out the grill <laughs> and the bumper. Woo wee! Now, I don't know about you guys, but that's night and day difference. Night and day. There's one thing about this bumper. I think it was hit, so there's this gap on this side. As for this side, it's nice and tight. But man, just look at that paint, look at that paint. And cue music now. Wait, hold on, okay, okay. Cue music. I also wanted to say, if you guys liked the video, uh, be sure to like, uh, subscribe, and make sure you tell friends about it, you know, uh, let's spread spread my channel out, you know what I mean? Uh, tell your friend, tell your friend's friends, tell your mom, tell your daddy, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, just spread the word. Uh, let's go and try to hit a few more subscribers. Right now, I, I believe I have like seven. I started this channel about, how long ago? month two months i don't know i make videos each week uh so i can work with my schedule because I, I work too but anyways uh pretty soon you will be seeing guest appearances uh i think we're gonna have uh, my friend pretty soon he has a mazda speed 3 that he's um he's replacing the engine uh we're not gonna really see him replacing the engine but when it's finished which should be pretty soon we should be seeing that. Uh, my friend, uh, Kid Rockabilly, um, his truck is going to get some work done to it too, so we'll be seeing some of that. I also have a buddy of mine with an S2000, and actually my cousin has a, a Focus ST. So we'll be seeing a lot of cool cars pretty soon, and hopefully you guys can stay tuned for that. I've been Toasty. I really appreciate you guys watching. Uh, make sure you guys leave down in the comments, in the comment section down below, uh, what you guys want to see next and, you know, some things you guys liked or didn't like. I'm always welcome to feedback, positive or negative, you know, as long as it's, it's in a constructive criticism way. I'm always open to feedback. Whatever you guys want to leave in the comments, I'll be sure to read and reply to you guys. Another thing we also have to do is get the stickers for the truck. I also want to get custom stickers that, you know, say my name and hopefully my YouTube channel. If it's possible, just the link with my YouTube channel right now isn't so cool. I can't put youtube.com slash toasty. I mean, I could, but it'll be very hard to find me. So, um, we're going to figure that out. Uh, pretty soon, I'm going to go down to Herma Graphics and get those stickers printed out. So, I can put them on the, on the Super Duty Lightning, a.k.a. hashtag project street truck stay tuned for that guys thank you guys for watching cue the outro jeffrey